outside of my house right now. I'm sitting in the backyard just hanging out. And we got an airplane right here who's uh, spelling love you somebody. It's upside down, but definitely you can see love you. And uh, I don't know what the name is, but I love you too. Well, it's been quite a while since we actually been here to Disney Springs. Uh, we're back again here for Lisa's birthday lunch. We're we'll going to be going to the boathouse, but we have 45 minutes to kill. And there is a new Disney shop here we have not checked out yet. So, let's go Disney look at it. Disney style, that's what it's called. Yeah, Disney style. So first thing when you walk in, you got all the classic Disney hats and a big Mickey pretzel. Yeah, I actually like this. It's a Wendy shirt here, uh, or Wendy styled. Forty forty dollars, thirty nine ninety nine. It's a whole Peter Pan like oh, era here. Second start of the right and straight on till morning. You are. That's a cute. Thirty two ninety nine. Then you have like a. Ooh. A lost boy shirt. What's that running? Thirty-four ninety-nine. Huh. Nothing on the back. But yeah, so nice little like I live in Fantasyland. That's cool. Then I love these like books. Like journals, but they're like the old VHS tapes. Yeah, and it always messes with my head. I they're love like, it. Oh my word! They have a VHS tape. Stuff. I like the mugs though. Bell shirt. Sixteen bucks. Oh yeah, yeah. I like it. Old Tink. Yeah. Tink is going for thirty-six ninety-nine. And I'm sure you can use our pass holder discount in this store. I wouldn't see why not. Oh look at this. This hat's fun. The original top knot. <laughs> look at it. Just look at it. That's cute. <laughs> I like this. Love you to Neverland and back. Ah, oh, precious. I don't know how much. I don't see a tag. So it's free. We takes it. $36.99. Not bad. It's cute. It's kind of like retro. But yeah, this is great for Disney bounding. And Lisa's been into that as of late. This would be too warm. Yeah. yeah maybe the winter months because it's not like super, super heavy. Yeah. But like when it cools down. Yeah. Know. How much are you? I'm going to say 40 44 dollars right. Like 45 Not too bad. There you go. Forty-four ninety-nine. Yeah, okay, got the cups here. You can even get an Alice dress. Nice. Let's go for a spin. Yeah. You don't like that. No, I don't. It makes me too dizzy. But you got the Alice shirt. All right, it's a dress. I don't know. Hmm. Oh wait, hold on. I think it's like secretly in thirty-six ninety-nine. I like the Donald area. I like this. Hold on. I just really, I'm having a moment right now. I love this. $32.99. But that is so cute. Mickey. Oh. $39.99. It's cute. Oh, you Donald. Oh, you can get Goofy too. Yeah. Goofy, Donald. Oh, I love this shirt. This store is amazing. Get the hoodie. Very much you can Disney bound with. Although the velvet would get a little hot. This one. Eh, I don't know if I like that velvety feel, That's but I get it. That's the only thing, it's be too hot. Yeah. Maleficent. It's really cool. Oh, Cinderella. I really like this. Yeah. You got, you got little mermaids over here. Cinderella. Well, it's definitely a cool little store that's in there. Uh, a lot of good ideas that Lisa had, and I'm sure for anybody else who's into the whole Disney bounding thing, Lisa's been very into that as of late, so this store is definitely worth checking out. Heading into the Marvel store right now, see what we can find in here. I am, I am all about this Rocket Kid hoodie. This thing's amazing with the tail. It's so cool. Ah, Gamora. She is 32.99. Not too bad, 32. Oh, nice. nice. Very cool. 
So if you guys didn't catch that, what the cast member said, this is actually from the Mission Breakout in California and they shipped it over here to Florida. Nice. So here we are at the boathouse, and I fear I give you a little bit of the menu. They have a raw bar section, oysters on a half shell, boathouse lobster cocktail, wild caught sea of Cortez shrimp. I don't know what that is. Yellowfin tuna poke, jumbo lump crab and avocado. And then they have the launch, main lobster bisque, boathouse pimento cheese. Lisa and I were going for that firecracker shrimp. $16. We're gonna split that for sure. Little neck clam sounds amazing. Uh, sandwiches here, yacht club. I think I'm gonna go for the New England lobster roll. They have uh, fish features too, which uh, the fish tacos, which I believe Lisa and I had last time. I'm not really sure. That was about a year ago. Then you have your sea and shore, barbecue shrimp and grips. Baked lobster macaroni and cheese. That always looks good every time I see it. And then, yeah. And then on the back here, you have all your specialty drinks. Reds, whites, bottles, cans, Chardonnays, specialties, a little bit of everything. They have, that. that that's the list right there in the long view. That, so everything looks really good. Sitting right by a window, so we have a little bit of the view. Got to turn our heads a bit, but it's very nice. Such a beautiful day today. So right off the bat, what's nice about this place is you get complimentary rolls and obviously water. So here we went for the firecracker shrimp. You can already smell the heat that are coming from these jalapenos here. Last time we had them, they were fantastic. Very light breading, so we're gonna see if anything has changed in one year. Lisa gets the first bites and she is the birthday girl. Still just as good? Let's see. Mm. It is still so good. Very light breading. More shrimp, which I love. Good crisp to it. The heat is a lot more hotter than it was that I can remember last year. But it's really good. If you don't like hot stuff, I probably wouldn't recommend it for you, but we love the heat and this is fantastic. So Lisa and I both went with the lobster roll. Um this is $29.50 for this. It's supposed to be like what one pound? One, po one pound, pound, quarter pound lobster? I don't remember, something like that. I don't know, maybe it's just because I haven't dug into it. This is a lot smaller than what I thought it would be for a price point at 30, but it is lobster. So we're gonna dig into this and I'm gonna let you know. So first I just wanna start with a piece of the lobster because it is big that if I would pick it up, it's gonna fall. Just to like, I mean it is a good chunk of lobster, can you see that? You know. Okay, the lobster is very good. This is a cold dish. This isn't a served warm. Because I know in certain parts of Maine, they'll run it cold or run it warm. It's just a cold dish. It's pretty good actually. Very juicy. It's nice and fresh. I already tried the fries. They have a good seasoning on them, too. Yeah. I think I'm satisfied. Yeah. Alright, we just got done with our boathouse lunch. Yeah. Uh, what'd you think, Lisa? It was good. Yeah? The firecracker shrimp was awesome, as always. So, we so initially started with uh, the complimentary rolls. Then for our appetizer, we had the firecracker shrimp, which we've had before. 
That was priced at 1650. That was our second time having uh, the firecracker shrimp. So it was very good. It's always good. Very uh, light breading. More of the shrimp you get. Nice heat. Nice heat. And if you don't like spicy food, I do not recommend it. If you're all about that spice, get it. I mean, it's not like terribly hot though. Not to us. No, but then we were eating everything. Like we ate the I jalapeno the peppers, peppers and I had them too. You know, she had a green pepper, I ate the red. Um, so then we went to our entrees, which we both had the same thing. We well, both got the- New England lobster roll. Yeah, and, and they were priced at twenty nine fifty a piece. And it's served cold. Yeah, so don't expect going in there, eating it, think it's gonna be warm. Yeah, but it was good. I mean, the lobster was good, but Tony and I were talking um, after we ate it. It was, I'd eat it again. It was a very good roll, but I don't think it matched up to the price. Yeah, the, the price point there, I don't know. Um, the lobster was very big chunks, so that was good. And you do get a lot of it. You also get a whole lot of fried, like what I'm carrying is leftovers, and the only thing that's left over is fries, and it's like a giant. It's about so they, three orders. Yeah, so you get your New England lobster roll with a side of fries, but the fries took up more of the plate than the actual meal. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the uh, lobster roll uh, the lobster roll was small. I know sometimes videos don't show justice when you're looking at food of how big things are or how small they are, but it is definitely smaller than what I thought because I yeah. saw videos of what it looked like. I was like, oh wow, that's I heard it looks big and I told Lisa that and it was definitely a lot smaller than what I thought. The price point as we were talking about, as Lisa mentioned, $29.50. Now, I do know lobster is expensive, so I get the price point there. However, <laughs> the size of the lobster roll, I don't think matched the price, the price point. I don't, I don't think it really did. Oop, I don't want to get hit by a car. So, yeah, we're just walking right now because couldn't, couldn't find the car, but I found it now. Um, <laughs> If, so I get it. I get it because, like I said, lobster is expensive. If I owned a restaurant, I think I would probably mark it at maybe like twenty-four fifty. I think that's all it was worth to me. Was it good? Yeah, absolutely. Would I get it again? I don't know for that price point if I could justify getting it again. Yeah, I mean, when I said I would eat it again, like it's something I would eat again. Contemplate. I just don't know if I would spend the money on it. Exactly. Uh, definitely other things I probably would differently but all in all it's still one of our favorite restaurants we will always recommend this to everybody uh the price for everything like i said we had the firecracker shrimp at 16.50 two lobster rolls at 29.50 each uh she just had water so that was free i had a coke so that was like 350 uh the total bill was like 78 dollars and then we used our pass holder discount, which brought it down to $70 and then the $5 tax. So it was around $75, $75 for a pass holder discount. You're looking at $80, no discount, no alcohol. So if you're gonna drink on top of it, just like paddlefish, you're gonna be spending over $100, probably about your average price yeah. point. But, but they do take the dining plan. Yes, they so. do as well. So always keep that in mind too. So that's it. That's our dining review for Boathouse. Happy birthday, Lisa. Thank you. Getting old, this one. No, I'm not. No, she's not. Next time we will see you. Vlog finito.